Welcome back to my channel, Aunt Sahana Craft Kids. Today, I'm going to be doing a puzzle riddle. So, how to do this is basically, I'm going to have various puzzles with numbers behind them. Each number will represent the number of riddle I have to solve. If I solve correctly, I will get that puzzle. And I have a challenge for you guys. You guys are going to have to guess what puzzle this is. I'll give you a hint. It's like a religious thing about a god. Alright, so let's start. There's so many different puzzles. Wait, but before that, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It's on my craft kits. Alright, I'm going to choose this one. 11. Alright, right now I need number 1, so I'm going to have to search for number 1. Also, guys, none of them are in order, so it's all random. I don't know, where's number 1? After years of searching, I finally found number 1. Alright, but I'm going to have to first solve a riddle. Alright, guys, let's pay the riddle. So let's start with number one. All right. Okay. What can be seen once a minute, twice in a moment, but never in a thousand years? Now I've seen riddles like this, so I feel they're talking about um, like not literally the, the words. Okay, so I'm gonna look at the letters. All right. So wait, is there any M in moment? Yes, there is M. There's not in a thousand years. Oh, wait. Okay, it's M. Because look. Once in a minute, twice in a moment, and never in a thousand years. One M in a minute, two M's in a moment, and no M's in a thousand years. I think I passed this one very well. Let's see the answer. Let's see the answer. answer yes i got it guys so i get to use the first puzzle now let's look at it so number one. Oh, well here's your hint hmm what do you think has orange and black stripes tell me in the comments below okay now i have to search for oh look at that number two is right here let's continue guys i know that this only has 18 riddles so i'm going to go to another video for riddles So riddle number two. <laughs> Guys, to make this harder, let's do it in the required time. Because we're just pausing the video and do it. Okay. Which tire doesn't move when a car turns right? Oh dear. Um Oh the spare tire. The spare tire doesn't move. <laughs> a car's has spare tires behind. If you have a Jeep, you usually have it. Let's see. Ooh. you spare tire all right guys i think i'm rocking this thing don't worry guys i know you're desperate for craft and challenges and we will do that because i might meet my friend soon Ooh, guys look at this puzzle so we can see that he has some golden scepters guys this definitely does not match remember they're not in order so they're not going to match till we have like a few other all right, next riddle. Wait, I need to first find number three. Guys, comment down below if you really enjoy this. Okay, number three has disappeared. Ugh. Guys, next time try to keep it more organized, but not like me. I am not the type of organized person. You saw how messy my workspace was. Um, I still, oh, there it is, three. All right, <laughs> let's move on. Oops, an ad. <laughs> Guys, I have seen like many ads like repeat and repeat. They were so annoying. Okay. I'm not alive, but I have five fingers. What am I? Okay, now this is, I don't think I know this one. I'm not, wait, I'm not alive. <laughs> if I don't solve this guy, it's like, again, yeah, just a puzzle. Guys, I have a feeling that this is not like something with actually five fingers. Maybe it's like just five spots. I don't know. Hmm. Oh, oh, gloves, gloves. Wait, wait guys, I'm gonna explain. I just wanna check. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Yes guys, if you wanna know how I got in the last second, first I kept on thinking, is it a clock? Is it a clock? But then I'm like, um, maybe it actually does have fingers, just 
spots for the hands. And the only thing that would work is gloves. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, yeah, baby. All right, what's puzzle number three? Ooh, I think I know who this is, so it's gonna be easy. And looks like we have a match. Hang on. Yeah, that was surprising. So guys, you can see that they have, oh my goodness. They, oh wait, they have two hands, yeah. <laughs> I thought they had three for a second. All right, let's continue. I remember I saw four somewhere here. Uh, guys, I think I'm going to need a puzzle tracker. I can't find any of the numbers. All right, I'm still looking. Oh, there it is. All right, next. All right, number four. Which word is written incorrectly in the dictionary? I think I know, guys. Incorrectly. <laughs> I know this one, guys, because the word incorrectly itself... So, which word is written incorrectly in the dictionary? The only word that says incorrectly is incorrectly. <laughs> like, gloves. Which word is written gloves in the dictionary? Gloves. <laughs> mm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Guys, I am killing this. And really, if I get it wrong, then I'm just going to have like a lost puzzle piece. So, that's not good. Okay, guys, we're getting somewhere close. I'm gonna see if this fits anywhere. Yeah, I'm gonna take that as a no. Nope, doesn't fit anywhere. All right, number five. Oh, I found six, so I'm gonna keep six like aside because I don't wanna lose six. All right, five, where is five? Guys, it's the most frustrating thing you have ever done in your entire life, I promise you. Oh, I found 10. All right, did I mention we have 45, 48 puzzle pieces? That's why we need 48 riddles. All right, Ooh, I found eight, nine. I'm gonna keep that aside. Uh, oh, five, yay, found five. Let's continue. And I won't have to find six, six eight or nine. Okay, skip. Okay, a truck drove to a village and met four cars. How many vehicles are going to the village? Hmm, wait. A truck drove to the village and met four cars. Wait, they go at the same... Okay, yep, guys, I remember this riddle. They're go it's only one. Because... Wait, let me see if it's right, though. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Yeah! Because, I mean, it's a one-way, like, think about it, guys. It's like a one, two-way path. So like forward and backwards. So there's no way like they can just cut you like that. If they didn't cut you, how would you see them? So they're going the opposite opposite way. I mean they oops. I mean they never said which way they're going. Alright guys, next puzzle. And let me see. We're six. Oh wait, I remember I kept it here. Guys, I almost forgot to show puzzle five. And this is what we have. I think I'm starting to get a good think a view of like what this is. Hang on, I'm gonna flip it the other way because don't you notice this blue part? I think it matches with this. Our number six is also a sky. So I'm pretty sure I know where this is going. This is going, nope, it doesn't go there. That's sad. All right, so I think it goes with here. Nope, <laughs> let's keep on searching. All right. All right, oh, wait. People buy me to eat, but never eat me. What am I? Guys, the only thing you can buy from a grocery store that you don't eat is plates, forks, knife, pan, you name it. You use all of that to make your breakfast, but you never actually eat it. All right, let's see. Oh, oh yeah, I got it. Okay, it's just plate here, but it could be a fork, a knife, basically anything. All right, let's continue. All right, guys, guess who has seven, eight, and nine in their hand? Yep, me. I found them all. So let's answer the next questions three in a row. And let's see what the answers are. Oops, ah. Okay, yeah. Oh, oh. We kill and we give life? We are either poison or fruit? You choose? Okay. What are we? 
Oh, maybe food? Because if you eat too much, you can kill and no, no. Guys, I don't know. Wait, wait, we can't see the answer. <laughs> Guys, we have to first think about it. Guys, I give up. I thought of all possible things, but I am not sure. So since I do not have an answer for this, that means I get one strike. If I get three strikes, uh, when we do a challenge with one of my friends, I'm going to get a severe consequence, guys. I do not lie to you. Because I can do it here. I mean, I'm not so trustable alone. <laughs> okay, guys. Let's see what the answer is. Huh? What? Words? Wait. How? Oh, my goodness. Guys, if you got that, give a thumbs up. All right. Oh, which hand is best for us? Stirring sugar into a cup of tea. Um, the spoon's hand. I think. <laughs> the handle. All right. Yes! I knew it. Wait. Oh. Okay, guys. I'm not cheating. Um, I mean, sp a spoon handle is close to a spoon. All right. Oh, whoops. Feed me and it will give me life, but give me a drink and I will... Oh, fire, guys. I've asked this riddle 3,000 times. You, If we put things in a fire, it just grows and grows and burns it. Give it water. Poof, that's the end of it. Whee. Give a thumbs up if you got that. Let me be direct. <sighs> There the ads. Oh wait, that reminds me. That's all. That's all the three riddles. All right, okay, guys. The moment I was waiting for. And boom! Pow! Explosions everywhere. Ooh! So three new puzzles. These are all yellow pieces, so we won't have to worry about it. But this, I think this might actually come in handy. I mean, we have this. Guys, this is <laughs> it's not looking good. I think it's in the corner like that. Guys, help me here. If you know the answers, give a thumbs up. Um, I'm not sure. All right, I guess we need a ton more. All right, guys, let's see if you guys can find 10. I already found it. Okay, let's zoom you in. Zoom. Did you guys see 10? Because I already did. All right, let me review the answer. Bingo! If you didn't see that, guys! Alright, either way, oops, my Chromebook turned off. It's fine. Oh, I wasn't supposed to show you 10. No! Alright, okay, fine, guys. So, I accidentally showed number 10 to you, but that's alright. At least it gives me a hint. So, where am I supposed to put this? Look, guys, tiger skin. So, this means this piece will belong with this one. All right, so if I figure out where to put it though. And I also noticed something else. Look, the tiger's body. So these three pieces have like a connection. All right, let's continue. Right, question number 10. Well, yeah, let's skip to 11. All right, 11, we gotta skip to 11. 11, 11, 11. All right. All right, question, oops, question number 11. What flies when it's born and lies when it's alive and runs when it's dead? Um. Uh. Guys, that's two strikes for me. I don't know. <laughs> don't tell me. Snow? Oh my goodness. I don't even understand. <laughs> Guys, two strikes. Okay, for the sake of my lives, let's do another one. Guys, I recommend you subscribe to Bright Side. It's amazing. All right, so we're doing another one, and we have covered, um, what have we covered again? Ah, oh, right, sorry. <laughs> We've covered 10 questions, and so we need 38 more, guys. For the sake of this long video, I might cut it short. All right, let's continue. Like this one. And I'm not so, talking. This one will talk for you. Fiddles that will test your brain power. Mine. And yours. <laughs> Our. Our brain is a mysterious thing. 
We know more about stars than about the things inside our heads. Okay, guys, I don't think you want to learn them. Counting down very close. Okay, so what is the mistake they have in common? Oh, wait. Guys, I think I found out. Look at the... I've seen this before, so look at the eyeballs. How do they look? If you if we didn't even see the face and just the eyes, they look like straight, like if they were facing upright. So if it's turned around, their eyeballs are going to look crazy. You'll see. <laughs> Time still ticking. All right, guys. Let's see. I'm, I think I'm right. Let's turn the photos upside down. See, look how weird that is. The eyes. That's the thing. Look how weird that looks. Guys, that looks so weird. And they were only smiling because when upside down looks like a smile. And lips of both women are upside down. But your brain doesn't recognize that immediately. The thing is, the brain is not used to seeing oh, eyes please, no. tongues upside down. You can touch the left and never Nope. Mm -hmm. Okay. Test number six. Oh, there are only seven? Does this t shirt have? What, mine? Oh, 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 no, <coughs> All right. So one, all right, one, two. So we have one, two holes. And guys, I'm not getting tricked. Three, four, five. Oh, wait, I forgot about the bottom six. If you guys think six is the answer, give yourselves a thumbs down because that's not correct. Guys, remember, we have the other side. So if you like put the shirt, if you like if the shirt is 3D, that means there's two more, eight. Now do you guys agree with me? If you do, give it give a thumbs up to yourself because I think that's correct. I think. The question doesn't specify which holes exactly, so the right answer is eight. They See. Have a neckline, two sleeves, yep. the bottom of the t-shirt, and four holes in the middle. Two in the front and two in the back because we can see the background through them. Test number five. All right. <gasps> guys, I totally forgot. We were supposed to use puddle, puzzles. Oh, puddles. All right, so we found in total of 10. So let's find 11, 12, and 13. Bingo, found 11. That was easy. And hmm, I found 18, 13. Oh, wait, 13, yay. All right, so now I need 12. Guys, you see 12? I'm desperate searching for it. Oh my goodness. And guys, I don't think we can finish this video in like, uh, we can finish this video, but it'll take probably half an hour. So I'm gonna cut it right now. Not now, but like a little later. Here they are. Let's do our Magnificon flip. Or just a throw up. Wait. Okay, that didn't work. Guys, we have so many puzzle pieces. Okay, let's organize this thing. So we have this. Is there any top for it? We have this too. And the tiger and this fairy. Yeah, guys, it's a tiger. So we know that this goddess has a tiger. So do you guys know my this my religion? My religion? You then you'll figure it out. Oh, and look at that. It fits. Okay. So maybe this goes here. Oh wait, yeah, it does. Look at that, guys. <gasps> you would not believe it. I. Never mind. <laughs> guys, no, that's not it. Okay. Oh, guys, look. Maybe this will fit like this. Um, no, it doesn't. All right, let's move on. Let's move on. Name this tree. Ooh. Uh, I name it the bird tree. Guys, you might be thinking, what the heck? This does not look like a bird tree. But I'm going to give you time to figure out why I called it that. Remember, your imagination. Okay, this is weird. <laughs> Write okay. the names that came to your mind in the comment section below. Really? But the actual right. challenge was to notice the camouflage bird See? trick. See? Because I noticed that little beak there, and there's another one in the side. If you did, well done. Wow. See? You see that beak and everything? Oops. That's one. Test number four. Oh, nope. I'm not forgetting this time. Puzzle time. Okay, so we did 13, so we need 14. I found 15, not 14. I'm gonna say, oh, oh. 
it almost dropped it. I'm saving 14. Oh, I mean, I found 14. I'm saving 15 for later because I'm not searching for 15. All right. So, boom. Guys, this helps so, so much. Because look at that. I think we might have some matching pieces. So, guys, if you thought this goddess had only two arms, you're wrong. Four arms, guys. So, this goddess has four arms. All right, let's put it together. So, do you recognize this goddess? It's she. This goddess has a tiger. And yes, it's a she. You can notice all this makeup. And she has four arms. Hmm, who do you think that can be, guys? It's the biggest hint. Okay. But now I'm going to need a place for this hand. Where do I keep this hand? I'll find, I'll find a place for later. All right, let's move on. Can you manage this one in five seconds? I'll give you 20 seconds, but try to solve it as fast as possible. Guys, I found the mistake. Look carefully. I'll give it at the last, last second. <coughs> I'll give you a hint. It's not in the numbers. It's in the question. Spot, spot. There are two spots. The mistake is not in the numbers or their colors. The mistake is that the word spot appears twice. See? And for a many short text. Right. Beep. Yay. Oh. Test Almost forgot. <laughs> I need to start remembering. Ta-da. Oh, guys, look, this is her face. She looks very pretty. All right. All right, so I'm going to keep that there. And remember this big thing? Now we can use it, I think. All right, so we know that she has now a huge thing. Guys, if you didn't guess it, I'm going to be so mad. It's so easy now. But I don't blame you. Okay, so there's a lot going on here. So I'm going to start by, like... <laughs> seeing what we have all right all right so we know we have this background that does not match with anything all right guys we need more puzzle pieces. i take my word, words back guys look it matches yay okay so we have finally one match well actually a couple now i think we can put this hand maybe here because i noticed that it kind of matched with the spears a bit like this wait 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 let me see if it works no, it doesn't. All right, let's move on. For real. Hey, okay, guys, let's continue. Number three. Do you see a hidden baby? No, that's not mine either. Guys, I cannot see a hidden baby. Where is a hidden baby? Like, there's... Guys, I found the hidden baby. Look at that. Do you see its eyes and its mouth? This whole thing's a baby. Look, that's its legs. Wow. See Wait. The outline of a baby yeah. In the fetal position. All right, guys, let's move on. Ooh, oh. <laughs> guys, have you seen this ad? All right, let's move on. Oh, I think it's obviously A. But it's also test, so I'm going to go with B. This is called reverse analogy. Basically, you choose what the opposite of what you want to choose. It's good for, it's for good luck. You can choose a right if you can choose A B guy if you want. I'm choosing B. Of course, line A is longer. Yeah. So oh, you want? Right? Well, not for everybody, or rather, not always. There was a research on conformity that looked like this. Five people were asked which of two lines was longer. The answer was always simple, but four of the tested people were asked to lie. So technically, there was only one real subject. The people lied. Bruh, I don't even understand this riddle here. <laughs> Okay. Spot Mike Wazowski. Ah, look, guys. Let's see if we can spot him. I, I'm looking through these goblins. Oh, where could he be, guys? You see my mouse? Oh, wait. Hang on. I'm going to pause this video and cheat. <laughs> where in the world is he? Oh, there he is. Mike Wazowski over here, guys. Wow, that's actually a good hiding Let's spot. Talk about your results. Ta -da. If it took you more than 20 seconds to answer each question. Or okay, guys. Forget about results. I answered three questions. Time for three reveals. Ta-da! Oh, wow. All right, ta-da. Oh, guys, we got this beauty's uh, second face, too. Look at her. She looks so nice. Okay. Ooh, 
and we got our tiger's face. Or is it the tiger's face? Yes, it's the tiger's face, his ears. And I think we might have a match here soon. Look at that, guys. <coughs> so we have this now. Oh my goodness. Oh, this makes it easier. Look, we attach our face like that. Guys, we are so close to solving this. Okay, I don't wor know where the others. Okay, the next one, I am going to just search right, for guys. So, I didn't see the answer. I covered my hand, so I don't know what this is. All right. What two things can you never eat for breakfast? Well, you can't eat chicken and goat. Um, I know. Lunch and dinner. <laughs> There's a, you can't eat lunch during breakfast. It's, or else it's called brunch. Okay, guys, I deserve the 20th piece. Guys, this is so good. Look at that. We have such an enormous match. I mean, this whole thing. Look at that. All right. So I think we can attach this now. Did you guys guess who she was? Well, if you didn't, please subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you soon. Yes, guys, I'm leaving for now. But don't worry. There's going to be a part two. Bye.